Hello everyone and welcome to Harvest English Institute's Language Tips. Today we're going to talk about idioms. Idioms are a really fun way to get into the culture and the language itself. However, they all give us all a hard time because frankly, they're just strange sometimes. So the first idiom I'd like to talk about, we're going to talk about idioms in topics. And the topic we're going to cover this week is water. So idioms using water. The first one, let's look at the screen, is it's raining cats and dogs. Yeah, I know. It sounds really strange. Cats and dogs raining from the sky. The image of that just really is strange. But what we really mean by that is that it's raining cats and dogs. It's raining very, very hard outside. That's all. So if you'd like to use this in conversation, you could say to your friend, hey, you better take your umbrella because it's raining cats and dogs outside. And it's just a more fun and colorful way to express yourself. So the next idiom I'd like to introduce to you is it's water under the bridge. So let's take a look at the screen. Now you're probably thinking, oh, water under the bridge, bridge, water, hmm. However, what this idiom really means is that there is a situation, probably a bad situation that really now it doesn't upset you that much anymore. You've decided, I've accepted whatever it is. And so it's water under the bridge. So one way we can use this in conversation, the brothers had been fighting for almost 10 years, but now they've decided that all of their problems are water under the bridge. All right, that's it for today. Talk to you soon. Bye.